Wait, whoa, what the? I don't think so, somehow, boys. Ooh. We all good? Holy. Now, I'm just walking through town and shit is popping off. Like, what the hell? There was no need for that. Jesus. Still, let's let's grab some ammu ammunition. Um, so welcome back, guys. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption Two. It's it's getting crazy, you know. Um, we look a little different, as you can tell. We changed the threads. We're looking slick, if I do say oh, so wow. myself. But I have really spent the cash. Let me just show you real quick. I want to show you what I spent it all on. So let's go first person here. Carbine. Check this out. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Oh my god. It's gorgeous. It's just, it's cost me everything. It's got a scope on it. It's got some, I think that's walnut. Oh, it's beautiful. It's got gold plating engravings. Yeah, it's beautiful. And then, of course, you know, I couldn't stop there. This isn't as sexy. It was halfway there. I ran out of cash before I could finish it. But we've got like an... What is that? That's like some sort of pearly grip. So we've got a pearly grip. We've got some black steel up on there. It's gorgeous. So we spent the monies. But that's okay. Not in a loose sleep over, eh? Anyway, I would rob these. Shall I rob these clowns? I mean... I don't know. They might, it might be considered a crime. I don't know if I can do that. I'm going to go in here. I want to... Settle! Wait! Hey. Up! Easy! If you start, I will shoot this place up. Wow! They shot me first, you know what I mean? Now this is why we're here. Hello there, sir. Got something in mind? Yes, I want a lovely haircut, short back and sides, make me look good. Let's go sweat back fade and have it right short. Yeah, look at that. That's lovely. That's what the doctor ordered. Saw this here soup strainer and got inspired, huh? Beard. I'm happy with that. Like a good beard. Well, I'm looking sharp. Right. Don't mess with me, folks. I am a dangerous man. This time, all right. All right, son. How What's we doing? Poison? I'll take a uh, whiskey. Just give me a drink, quick. I don't know what's going on. I, I keep spending my money. Having one for the road. Uh, take a shot. Another? No. No. I need to start earning. Oh, <clears throat> Arnold at the hotel said there was some commotion. Some new girls yep. trying to pull a fast one. Goodbye. Right, what oh, is shit. the plan? We've got some dead folk in town. Next place of business, we've got another bounty here, but we're not going to touch that just yet. So, we've got Jose out here, and I'm interested, actually. So, that is... That is exactly where we're going to go. We're going to go see our friend Hosea. And see what's needed. Parker. Maybe today is the beginning yeah. of the end. Right, we're on our travels, but uh, like I said... I am. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. What's going on here? Come on, Lord have mercy. Shit. Right. Well, you know, it's an opportunity. Let's seize the day. I was going to shoot that poor soul back there, but he seems to have disappeared. So, 
I guess we'll uh, we'll just loot this guy. Makes no difference to me. And this is what we're gonna do. We are ruthless outlaws. All right, where's Hosea? Interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. Uh, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. Prove ourselves to this clown? What are you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now, you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage, I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> Hell yeah. Let's get robbing. Really? Really. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? The other one is... Let's have a quick look. Make sure we can get the best route. Yeah. Out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Well, clearly you've recovered from your bear. <laughs> I am not a pathfinder. That's all you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy. Come on now. You're supposed to jump on your own. I'm not supposed to teach you when to jump. My God. We stick to the roads. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal the stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. So what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. So hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Doing it in broad daylight and all. Little There's bit cheeky. House. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Anyone around? Yes. Okay. 
someone on the porch. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show where you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Night. Let's wait. Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Right. So, he's open, he's not on the porch anymore. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all quiet. Good shout, good shout. I move in the shadows of darkness. I'm a ninja. I see nothing. Okay, looks good. Let's have a little sneak in. Holy smokes! Who sleeps there? What kind of person sleeps there? Holy. I was not expecting that. Oh my god, I really need money, so I hope we can get as much as we can. Platinum band. Money clip, yes please. Oh my god, this is a bit. Alright, medicine cabinet. Why not? Snake oil, no, I'm alright. Uh, we'll shut the cabinet so they don't know. that. Right, let's, do you think there's anything in the chest of drawers? Let's, yeah, let's have a look. Mate, this is so cheeky. Right, let's get further into the house. Oh, that was mental, man. Right. Got another chest? What the hell? Money clip. Pearl necklace, hell yeah. Carrots, of course. Shadow loves a carrot. Such so chimney, of course. Smokes. Now that's where it's at, but is there more to be had? Ooh, we're risking it. We are risking it, but I'm, I'm a bit desperate. <laughs> we're not going to greet Bob, that's for sure. Come on, there must be something in. No? Can I rob this? Gold jointed bracelets, yes please. Oh god, don't wake. Don't you dare wake up. Get it all closed so it's... if they wake, they won't suspect much, hopefully. Oh, hang on. That said search then. There you go. Oh, what have we got here? Coin purse, yes. Money, yes. Right, we have maximised our profits here, which is really good. Right, let's get the hell out of here. It's a good robbery. Went smooth. I did not expect a dude at the back door like that. Mental. Get on, dear boy. Right, let me on the stagecoach, dude. Hell yes. Let's go. 
Oh, might. Perfect. And it's a good night's work. You're gonna crash if you don't slow down. So no, we have I'm a base. From the house. Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. Slow down, you'll burn out the horses. Oh, okay, that might be no a thing. Doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. It wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye, and as usual, he did not flinch. Exactly. How long do you think we're going to stick around here for? Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Hey, you see there? Smashed it. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Uh, I'm gonna decline. Nah, I'll catch up with you later. Okay, stay out of trouble. Might not have been. Mm. Nice. Oh, that's so good. I think my my wallet's looking a bit better now. Um, let's have a look at that. 282. Oh my god, that's so much better. Right, so the reason I did come over and take this on is because I wanted to unlock a fence and it appears to me that he's closed at the minute. But we have unlocked the fence. And this is really good. So, it says wait until morning. So we can totally do that. Now, the fence is critical because we can get pamphlets from this geezer. We can unlock plenty of craftable items from it, which is going to be really useful. But I really wanted him for dynamites. Because I've been planning a train robbery. And where's that? Where's the where's Seamus' joint at? Jesus. Okay, boy. Let's have a look at that. And we're gonna need dynamite essentially, because there's gonna be safes on on the um, on the train. So, let's see if we can acquire some bits. Now, I don't know if he's quite opened up yet. It might be a few minutes before he fully opens up. You okay, boy? So, the fence ain't opening up. Don't know what's going on there. Um, I guess... We'll leave it for now, and we'll uh, try them another time, trying to get our dynamites. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you're enjoying the series. If you are, leave a like, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.